Let's take a look at the Salomon Active Skin 8 set. This is their 8 litre volume running pack. So we'll start off with some specs about this pack. So first off, the hydration is included. It comes in the form of two of these soft bottles. These are 500 millilitres each. You also have the option to add a 1.5 litre reservoir. And this goes into the pack and clips on here. The pack weighs 192 grams on its own, and when you add the soft bottles empty, it weighs 252 grams. It comes in four different colors, and it comes in five sizes, from extra small to extra large. I have a small pack, and I wear a small t-shirt, and it fits really well. So the pack is 80 pounds, however, it does come with a soft flask, like I said, and if you buy them individually, they're 14 pounds each, so that's 28 quid, so that means that the pack on its own is actually only 52 pounds, so that's really good. It does come with the soft flask, Unfortunately, there's not an option for it to come with a reservoir instead. I really wish that was an option, but unfortunately it's not. So Salomon say that this provides easy hydration, freedom of movement with soft fabrics, a quick closure system, and accessible storage. This has the sensor fit tech along with the quick release sternum strap here so you can quickly adjust on the go. It also has the 3D mesh all around for breathability and the ability to stash these pockets really well. It has one zip pocket on the front here. The right side does not have a zip. It has two openings for your soft flasks. It has the pouch to put your reservoir in, like I said, and this little pinch clip to keep it in place. And then there's a little hole down here where the tube for the reservoir comes out. On the back, it has this massive waterproof bag section with a key holder in it and a tiny little Sort of extra pouch to keep anything small in and then also it has this strap system on the back which you can use to tighten the pack if you haven't got very much in there so let's talk about a few things that i like about this pack so first of all is the comfort it's so comfortable i absolutely love this pack when i first got it i really thought i'm not gonna like it i sort of put it on set up all the water bottles and was like mm, it feels a bit bulky however i just ran down the road and within half a mile i'd sort of forgotten it was there um, it's so lightweight, I just find it so incredibly comfy. For me, that is one of the biggest things I like about this pack, is you just kind of don't notice you have it on, and that's led to me wearing it for basically every run I've ever done since I bought it. The next thing I like about it is these front pockets. They're so good. They're designed really well. They're really durable. I absolutely batter them because I throw whatever I want in there. Keys, phone, camera, gels, bars, bananas. Another one is the durability of the pack. That leads straight into the next like. So I wore this over a harness that I used to tow a drum kit for a challenge and the harness was really bulky but even with that harness on i could stretch this over the top and still fill it up and absolutely batter it and i ended up running in this over 100 miles with that on towing the drums on the hottest day of the year in the uk and it held up extremely well so then that leads me on to my next like, which is the breathability of the pack, because I have worn this on the hottest day of the year in the UK, and I wore it all day. I, <laughs> that challenge lasted 47 hours, and they were the two hottest days back to back, and I wore this for the entire challenge, and it was incredible. The breathability of it is really, really good. All this 3D mesh, you can see it all here on the inside and actually it's extremely breathable. You can see if I hold this up, you can slightly see through it. You can see here, you can see the, the little blemishes that I've made to it. I have killed this pack. I think I've worn it for over 400 runs. So that's quite a lot. And a lot of them have been pretty long. This has basically been my pack that I've worn for every run, for every race, every single bit of training I've done for the last probably year and a half. So my next like is the quick link sternum straps. I absolutely love this. It's so quick to get on and off. It's really easy to adjust as you're going. It's just it's just so quick. Running into aid stations on races, you can have it off in seconds, you can turn it round, refill your reservoir, and then you can have it back on, and you can be doing it up as you're running away from the aid station. And that's really useful, because it's just so quick and so amazing. To be honest, it's a little bit battered, but it's never broken, and it holds really well, and I can keep making it tighter or looser, and I've never had a problem with it. So another like is price. Obviously, it's 80 pounds. It comes with the flasks. The flasks are really useful, in other situations as well. I find that 
I use the reservoir more often, however you can still just put a bit of water in a flask and stick it in the back, or you can put the flasks in your drop bag. So having those flasks is really useful. So really the pack's only about 50 pounds, which is really, really good. It's not so much a like of the pack, but however, fitting it with the reservoir I think is amazing. I always use the reservoir when I go for any long run with this pack. I just think they're such a great way to get your hydration on board. So for me, the fact that this can take a 1.5 litre reservoir is a big plus. Okay, so I've got a couple of dislikes and my first one is this sort of waterproof backpack area. On a hot dry day, things can get quite sweaty in here and you find that everything just builds up a little bit of a layer of moisture, which is not very nice. I'm not really sure if that's possibly fixable. I equate it to being in a tent on a warm morning. If you know what that's like, you know that you just have to get out because it's horrible. You just bake in there. So it's probably the same thing happening here. It might be unavoidable. However, it is something to note. Uh, however, if it's a hot, dry day, you can leave it slightly open to let it breathe, but it just doesn't fully work, unfortunately. Another thing is that there's like a little like silly thing on here is that there's a whistle, which is like absolutely terrible. So here it is, this little one. It's, it's crap, it's honestly crap. I don't really see the point in them adding it. If they're gonna add a whistle, why don't they just add a good one? No one's really gonna hear you with that, are they? I mean, maybe if someone's close, but yeah, just put a good whistle on it. And then my last dislike is that it only comes with a soft flask. I really wish there was an option to change the reservoir, because for me, the reservoir is so much more useful I use it 95% of the time over the soft bottles. So I think it would be a really good option actually to say like, oh, I'll pay five pound more, but I'll have the reservoir instead of the soft flasks. For me, that'd be amazing because I could actually just go completely without the soft flasks. So to sum up, this is a really, really great vest. It's great if you just want something to put your phone in to do a 5K. Maybe you're going for a trail run and you don't want it in your pocket in case it falls out and also you can go up to 100 miles in this easily. So for me, if I'm going up to 100 miles, I'll probably jump up to the Advanced 12. However, I have done over 100 miles in this pack and it did really well. For marathons, 30 milers, 40 milers, 50 milers, I'm always going with this pack because it's so lightweight. It is really versatile. It's just a really amazing pack. And for the price, you just can't go wrong. So I mentioned the Advanced Skin 12 and I have a review of that up here if you'd like to have a look at it. And then I've also got another video comparing the two down here in case you want to have a look at that. I've got this Rockman clothing on. They're an amazing Welsh brand who promote resilience through their clothing brand and there's a link for 20% off in the description. Remember to like, subscribe and hit the bell to be notified of when I upload. If you've got any questions, drop them in the comments below and I'll see you in the next one.